Hi, I'm here to show you my lions, at least part of them. And on this wall, there are several of them, and I'm gonna tell you who they are. Each lion has an aspect of creator's heart. And this tall one here, the blue one, well, I guess they all kind of have blue, but the one in the middle is a tall one. That is compassionate one. And he rises to show you compassion. Isn't that cool? And then the one at the top that's more purple, that is the one who sees. And he sees inside of you. He sees all your pain and all your hurt and all the guilt you might carry. And he cares. He cares about that. And this one is Warrior King. And this is the one who's gonna break back through the veil and he's going to bring peace on the earth, but it's gonna come as a warrior in order to do that. And this one in here is my stone tower. And he's the one that we can rest beneath. And this one down here is the watcher. And he's watching us all the time. You see those eyes? And when I do these lions, I start with the eyes, so they're looking at me the whole time. And by the time I end the painting, I know who they are. And this one is the watcher. He's watching everything, making sure that everything is going the way it should be in our lives. And here is the judge. I don't have the original of this. I sold the original, but this is a nice print. And this is the one and true judge the judge that judges rightly. And that will be a day that will be very special when that happens. And this is love is on the move and he's out to get you, but not to eat you, just to love you. The top one up there is spirit in the sky. I loved painting that one because my native friends love to dance to the song spirit in the sky. And so I had that song playing the whole time I was painting him. And this one below him, that one is Jesus on the cross. You probably didn't recognize him, but you see that is the veil of death coming down over his face and he's giving his last snarl and he says, I'm gonna be back. And that's why Warrior King that I just showed you a little while ago is breaking through the veil, breaking back through the veil. This one is through the fire. And this one is really speaking to my heart right now because Kat and I are going through the fire and he goes through the fire with us. He's in the middle of it all with us. He's not a God far off. And this one is my defender. And you don't wanna be in front of him. You want to be behind him because he's the one who's fighting the battle for you. And I think that's very important that we can be still behind him while he fights the battle. So you can see that angry, mean face. He's going after our enemies. And the one above him, I can't quite show you. I'll have to go across the room. This one is bears my sorrows. And you see he's sorrowful one he he's carrying our sorrows and he feels everything that we feel and this one down here is listening one and he tunes his ear to hear everything that we say to him he never misses a thing and this one is the grieved one and he's grieved over all the people who have turned away from him and who have not accepted his, his offer of free grace and an eternal life. And then this one is the very first one I ever did. And this one is Lion of Judah. And he's always there for those who have eyes to see. But as you can tell, you have to look carefully to spot him there. And so that's all the lions I have on the wall right now. I'm getting ready to work on another one. Kat and I just got out of the hospital. Kat had a stroke. And while we were there, when they took him up to the second floor, 
there were like 50 ravens who were out there outside our window just welcoming us. And ravens in the Bible represent God's provision. And every day we were in the hospital, there was at least one raven outside our window watching over us. And I believe that's God's sign of provision for us. So I'm going to do another lion called My Provider. And I'm looking forward to that. Right now on my easel, I'm getting ready to paint a tree. <laughs> and that's something different. But as I look outside, you see that tree right there? I love that tree. And so that's my next painting project. So God bless you and have a great day. I hope you enjoy my art for now. I'm starting with the lions and putting those up so that you can enjoy them in your home. I'd really like to hear from you and let me know what lion speaks to you because almost everybody has at least one of these lions that really speaks to their soul. So please let me know which one and I will talk to you later. Have a great day.